I'm here to show you three creative ways to use Magic Mask. Let's jump into the first effect, Color Correct. The ability to correct element colors in a video has a wide range of applications, and it's pretty simple to do. Put a clip on the timeline, go to the Color tab, click here to select the Magic Mask. To facilitate the visualization, toggle Mask Overlay on, because now it's time to mask the element you want to color correct. In my case, I will mask this girl. Now, with the span, draw your mask. As you can see, the mask is highlighted in red. However, it is only in one frame and we want it to follow the person throughout the video. To do that is also very simple because Magic Mask has an option for automatically tracking masks, which is these two hours here. Click on it and wait for the process to finish. It takes a little longer. Look, we have now the mask all over the video. You can turn off the mask overlay in this panel to see all the color information in the selection we will create. For example, we can change the primary colors and the image gain based on RGB and increase or decrease the contrast or the temperature. Not only that, in this option, we can amplify the shadows, dark and white, light and saturation as well. Do you see? Pretty simple, right? Let's move on to the next Magic Mask application. But before, one thing might be clear. If you are going to use the Fusion tab to add something over the effects that I'm showing you, remember to create a new Fusion clip before the Magic Mask. Background replacement is also possible with the Magic Mask. Put a clip on the timeline, go to the Color Effect panel, and here is the same thing we did before. With the mask overlay on and this pen selected, you can mask what you want to preserve, which is the environment without the sky. It doesn't need to be perfect, but try your best. By the way, you can use this pen here with a minus to correct some wrong selections on the video. Once you've done it, track the mask throughout the entire video, deactivate the overlay option and turn the highlights to on to see the disappeared background. Move to the notes panel, mouse right click, add an alpha output and connect the video to this little circle. Go to the edit tab, grab the clip which contains the wanted background and put it under your main video. And that was it how to easily replace a background with Magic Mask. All right, now follow me to learn the last Magic Mask effect. The cloning effect is somewhat harder. However, I will show you how to easily run over it. Click on a clip on the timeline, hold out and drag the clip up. Go to the color tab with the pen selected, draw your mask and remember, always toggle the mask overlay on to see the mask highlighted. Once you've done it, it's time to track. Click on these two hours here and let the program track for itself. All right, with the process finished, move to the notes panel, mouse right click and add an alpha output and connect the video to the output like that. Now, move to the edit tab. The top clip is our subject, which means our person separated from the background. And the bottom clip is our background. Select your top clip, press out and duplicate this layer by dragging it up. In your inspector panel, you can move the video to the left, right, up and down. I will move to the right only. Another thing that we might do here is to pick the exact frame we want to insert the clone in our video. Select the frame you want and cut it with the blade. Mouse right click and cut it out. Move to the color tab again and track your mask forward and backward. In your edit tab, the model had been duplicated as you can see. However, the effect is not done because to create a soft transition, we need to put some background effects too. So, select your background clip and cut it exactly in the frame your clone appears. In the Effects panel, search for Fusion Transition. Here, you can add whatever transition you want. You can make the image rotate and slide left and right. You can add a glitch transition though, which is the transition that I insert to create my effect. And that was it! Three different ways to use the Magic Mask. And if you want to learn additional Magic Mask hacks, this next video is for you. Thanks for watching.